hello everyone welcome to the cloud network so in this tutorial i am going to show you how to install uh, windows 10 uh, the test uh, new version of this operating system and your in your virtual box so this is i am using 64 bit windows 8 uh, iso image and i'm going to show you where you can download and where how can you can install it so before installing you need to, you need to have minimum requirements you need to have 1 gigahertz processor or faster if you have 1 gb ram or support for 32 bit or 64 bit both are supported for this one and for 16 gb disk space free you need, you need, uh, you need to have 16 gb and a graphic card 1024 into 786 and you need to have a microsoft icon and you need to have internet access so this is the five important things you need to have before installing continuation so please remember this uh, these steps before you if you are you are going to continue so i have this already uh, steps configured now this is the important notice that this technical preview only that expire on october 1st only so before you uh, install and configure accessing remember this expire on october 1st 2015 so first of all i am going to download virtual box and I'm going to show you about where you can download Windows 10 ISO image. So here is Google open your search box and type virtual box. Just click on this download look, download link and you will be redirected to here. This is a website of virtual box where you can download for the Windows supported. Just click on this link and it will be start automatic downloading. So here you can find for other supported uh, operating system Linux, Solaris, other things. So here in my channel you can find how to install virtual box. Just search and here in my channel you will find how to install it. To download Windows 8, just type in the Google search bar Windows 10 and you need to open this the first link. It will be redirect to your download page where you can see this the Windows 10 uh, technical previous image. Just scroll down. So here you can see the instruction is showing. Scroll down, you can find this download link is showing. These are the links and the product key is showing so which country you belongs to you need to find which country so i am belongs to uh, it's, uh, selecting the languages my select i am selecting english language us just click on this arrow and you can see this is for 64 bit supported and this one is 32 bit supported so this is the size showing 3 gb and this is size 3.92 gb is the size showing uh, showing just click on this download link it will be so here you can see this is the uh, download link download installation showing so which I have already downloaded this one and uh, I have already logged in into this account when you click on this download it will be redirect to your login page you need to log in your Microsoft account with the username and password after that you can download this one for the supported languages you can click for Chinese Italian French Japanese Russian so you can download here you can see which I have downloaded Windows 10 technical preview and this is the size this you can see 3.9 gb the size i'm open the virtual box uh, this is my virtual box and i'm going to install here windows click on new and then type windows 10 you need to select your microsoft either it has been selected or not type you need to select whether 32 bit or 64 bit uh, scroll down to uh, search for other things you know you can find this is one is your microsoft windows 8 you can select this one also just click on next and you need to assign your ram or uh, you need to assign your ram according to green point only do not go to beyond to the right point so click on next you need to create a virtual drive next and then you need to create this image then next we need to assign this hard disk image that i am giving 25 gb you can give at least 20 gb also and this is the location we is going to store and in, uh, in, in our system or laptop also so i am changing the location so you can see i have changed my location if you do not want to change this you can keep the default location click to create now and then you need to go to click on settings then you need to click on this floppy and check and then you need to uh, click whether the processor is okay everything go to storage click on empty you need to click on this or uh, choose virtual uh, dvd or cd disk file you need to click on this one and you need to find your windows 8 here is my windows 8 click on this one and then go to network click on bridge adapter before here you need to assign iso image where you have downloaded in your system or laptop then click ok then click to start now 
so we can see the logo is came for windows 10 smart voting i forget to tell you one more thing we need to change uh, uh, here in our version we need to select windows 8.1 uh, so for we are initially windows 10 now so we need to select this uh, supported for this uh, uh, windows 8.1 we can see windows 12 we do not need to select only we need to select 8.1 if you are downloaded iso image for 32 bit you need to select this one so you have to select this one 64 bit which i have iso image click ok and then click to start now now you can see on the screen you need to select your language installation if you want to select different language uh, you can select so click to next so if you want to repair this you can go ahead repair click to install now and it's going to set up starting now here we need to select accept this license agreement and click on next so here the important things you are showing windows setup which type of installation you want if you want to upgrade from windows 7 to windows uh, 10 8 if you want to upgrade from windows 8 to 10 if you want to upgrade from windows 8.1 to 10 means you can select this option i am installing the first installation so i am going to select this uh, custom install advanced only with this upgrade only what you can do is uh, your data will be safe and it's going to only upgrade here with the custom means we need to format your data so before uh, formatting you should take a backup of your data so before formatting you should aware of this so you can see this i click on new and i have given the partition for the installation this is system reserve so just you leave this by default and uh, before formatting you should remember you need to take a backup of your data otherwise it's going to be format so remember click to next and it's going to first of all copy then in setting the installation then it's going to install in features update finishing ups so it will take some more time half an hour here you can come you can till then you can have a coffee or tea also then i'm going to back with that now i'm getting ready this has been completed and it's going to restart after restart it's getting ready so now you can see setup of uh, you so you can get going fast so this is uh, we came to instructions automatically find connected to internet device this is a small instruction showing you can do it so scroll down you can if you want to customize means you can go for the click on customize and then so here you can see yes go for connect the home network so settings update your pc or application okay automatically find my updated pc if you want to put automatically you can put so this is help protect your pc privacy okay click on next and check online for the solution okay i'm going to put off this one next uh, this is share to information microsoft and now i do not want to share any information to the microsoft so i'm just putting everything to my off this one if you want to keep the on this you can keep and scroll down to find other things and go back to the then click on next then here you will see next you will set up your account so you need to wait here so you can see you need to sign up the account uh, if you don't have account means you can click and create an account you need to enter your ID, user id and the password for this microsoft account and uh, you need to click on next so after entering the account click on next so now you can see this uh, we have got the new application installing the application is so we need to wait here so now, you, so now you can see on finance screen this is the final installation windows 8 pre technical preview so you can verify this is startup menu internet explorer search bar is showing so desktop so you can find this is our new features is showing so now let us go so if you get any problem during the installation you can comment below to my video thank you for watching the cloudnet video please subscribe to cloudnet channel